everyone. It is now day five and we're starting to get used to being here in Japan inside the, uh, the village. I have some mixed emotions today. Um, the pressure is starting to get to me a little bit, I'm not gonna lie. Um, I'm not a huge fan of people watching me and I'm knowing that people are going to watch me dive. Um, so it's not like I'm struggling. It's just that I'm getting more anxious and more scared. <laughs> I know that my competition is not until August 4th, but yeah, I'm a little scared now. <laughs> it's almost like I rather want people to watch me only if I did a good job. So like if I know that I did a good job and dove well, I would love for people to watch because I know it's a good ending, but I don't know now. I don't know how I will do. Like, you never know. Like, diving is a sport that is very risky. You never know the outcome, and that's with any sport, really. But I'm just, I'm scared that I'm not going to do well, and literally the whole world will know. <laughs> and that's kind of getting to me a little bit right now. Um, I'm trying to stay positive, but that is stressing me out a little bit, but that's also what mental me mental practice and mental training is for, so I'm trying to work on myself, get ready mentally. Um, but I just wanted to be open with you guys and be honest and say that, yeah. I'm scared. <laughs> I did have a good talk to my dad about it today, um, where he was just reassuring me that it's not with luck that I'm here. It is with determination, hard work, blood, sweat, and tears, um, which makes me happy because sometimes you do feel like you're like an outsider and you don't really belong here but I actually do <laughs> I did I did earn my spot I I fought as hard as I could at World Cup to be here and now I'm here so it's not that I'm not grateful at all I'm super grateful it's almost like I just I don't I don't want this to be a bad ending I want it to be a good one and I know that I'm the only one who can make it to a good moment and to a good competition and I will fight to the very last dive in order for me to be able to achieve that but I just wanted to express my concerns because I believe that all athletes have this kind of feeling to a certain extent and I think it's important to, to talk about it and to reassure other athletes that this is, this is normal and just try and help each other because talking about it more makes it more normal and I'm just trying to <laughs> try to talk about it so I'm not sitting here all alone being crazy um but yeah so that's been not a sad start to my day but it's it's been impacting me a little bit my mood and I don't want it to I just want to be happy here which I am most of the time um, but that's how I feel in the moment. Sitting out here at this little park again. I'm waiting for dad. He's going to come down and we're just going to hang out here for a little bit. And then we are going to go to practice later today. So that's going to be great. And then later, diving is finally starting. So we're going to watch three meters synchro women. And I can't wait to watch all my good friends dive and crush it and kill it. And yeah, I'm just excited for this journey to start. I can't wait.
half, seven, seven, seven and a half, seven and a half, eight. Synchronization, eight, seven and a half, seven and a half, seven and a half, eight.
just got back to the room, uh, finished up a little workout at the uh, multi-complex facility where they have different workout things. Um, just did some light stuff and uh, yeah, I feel better. <laughs> um, mood is better. It's just, you know, one of those days. Um, but I'm a lot better now, so I'm happy about that. And uh, I'm just, I'm so happy to be here. So I can't wait. I think tomorrow I will have an early practice. So that's going to be fun. Um, wake up a little bit earlier than usual, but it's just go to bed a little bit earlier. Um, and yeah, I'm just, uh, just excited. <laughs> so yeah, good night.